Cetaceans are totally aquatic. In other words, they are born, grow, feed, breed, and die without ever returning to land. Anyone who has ever tried running in knee-deep water will confirm that fact. In spite of this reality, some cetaceans still manage to swim at speeds of 40 kilometers an hour. How have whales managed to evolve and adapt to the constraints imposed by such an environment? Well, first, by perfectly streamlining their body shape. Then, by developing an extremely efficient propeller. The vestigial skeletal elements of the hind limbs located within the animal's body now serve as anchorage site for the muscles of the reproductive organs. The lumbar and caudal regions of the skeleton have become substantially larger so as to provide a fulcrum for the powerful locomotory muscles. Their forelimbs are still well developed and are used as rudders to steer the animal. All the original limb bones are found within these limbs, the shoulder bone, the humerus, the ulna, the radius and the hand bones, the metacarpi as well as the phalanges.